what if somebody wants to create an OnlyFans account? What if what if they're listening to you to, tonight and they're like, you know what, this is something I think I'd be into or something I'd be interested in trying. Um, so let's abbreviate this a little bit and just cut right down to the chase. What would you tell people who are maybe interested in starting their own OnlyFans account? Uh, I would tell them pretty much the same thing I've told everybody else who's asked me, which is um, be aware that OnlyFans takes a 20% cut. Be aware that if you want to keep an audience, you're going to have to post fairly regularly. I mean, you don't have to post multiple times a day like I do, but, you you know, with some regularity if you want to keep an audience. And, um, and my number one tip is that the real money isn't in the subscriptions. It's in whatever you can get out of people from actually interacting with them one on one. Like uh, my subscription price is only like five dollars a month, which is practically nothing. But I mean, the real money comes from like I do customs, I do sexting, I do yada, yada, yada. And that's where the real money is. So you kind of have to strategize a little bit. Advertise yourself, promote, promote, promote but promote smart so you don't get shadow banned on every single social media website that exists. Uh, <laughs> and yeah, that's it. Awesome. I love it. And maybe, you know, some, some shower. Uh, oh yeah. Shower people yeah. Yeah. fucking love shower yeah. content. That's the other one. <laughs> All right. Do it anyway. Might as well film it. Yeah. I, I want that to be merch so bad. <laughs> <laughs> so badly. <laughs> All right. Um, let's wrap up. Uh, Rudy, how can people find you? Uh, you can find me on social media pretty much under Xcult Baby for everything. If you are specifically looking for stuff relating to my OnlyFans, try looking under the username RudyB123. That is my OnlyFans username. That's my Twitter that I have specifically for my OnlyFans username. Um, I occasionally post pictures onto that for the sake of promotion. And if you want to check out my OnlyFans, I the link that is like the standard link is a one day free trial. So, you know, you can check it out and see if that's the kind of thing you want. I mean, you can literally scroll through all of my content in like an hour. So, you know, check it out. If you like it, then stay subscribed. If not, then you have lost nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good. And if you liked the show today, if you want to continue to get in touch with us, uh, you can reach us on Twitter at Secular Sex. You can also call our ever popular hotline, which is 512-666-0-ASK. That's 512-666-0275. You can leave us a voicemail that we'll play on the air and answer your question in our mailbag episodes. And you can get in touch with us via email at sex at atheist-community.org. Also, if you're on Facebook, you should check out our fan page, which is modded by fans and um, put together by fans. We've got a really awesome community down there. Um, I don't know. I said down there, like Facebook is like geographically <laughs> below me. <laughs> it's I, mean, I think like, I feel like it, it resonates though, right? Down there. It's like earthy down to earth, bunch of, bunch of uh, Maybe not people. that so much. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> can we get a pic of the crew cam up here so we can thank our amazing crew? Crew. Appreciate Woo. everything y'all do. Crew cat. Some new new-ish uh, call screeners. Thank you all for all that you're doing. Um, and we are going to hop into the Discord after this real quick. So if you have questions that you'd like to ask us um, off air uh, or just want to uh, chat for a little bit before we wrap up for the night, feel free to visit that at tiny.cc slash ACA